Hi there guys and girls and welcome to this very quick video showing the features of Windows Intune to manage uh, autopilot devices and profiles. So here we are in the Intune console. We need to go to device enrollment, Windows enrollment and as you can see there are two new sections for devices and deployment profiles. First off we need to sync with Windows Business Store, so we need to press sync. That will take a few moments to uh, synchronize up. In the meantime, we'll have a look at the deployment profiles. Again, as you can see, they're blank. Um, I believe that you have to start from refresh, but again, as there are not a lot of options, then it's not a problem. So here you can see the synchronized devices from the Windows Business Store. As yet, there is not a way to upload new devices. That still has to be done through the Business Store. To assign a policy, we just click highlight the device, click assign. I have no po profiles defined here, but uh, we'll quickly define one. We'll go to deployment profiles, create profile, give it a name, as you can see in the future you'll be able to set this to uh, join Active Directory uh, domains as well. So again, we're just going to click the amazing amount of settings we've got available to ourselves, uh, as, it, as is for the Windows Store, sorry, the Business Store. We'll save that. We'll go back to our devices highlight the device you want to assign a policy to and click assign and that's it just the same as if you did do it for the Windows Business Store so once it's assigned that's essentially it um, you're done so in the future uh, obviously the ability to upload new CSV files uh, to retrofit will become available uh, and obviously the options to join to an Azure sorry a Windows domain uh, as part of the auto enrollment process as well will become available. In the next video, I'll be demonstrating how to manage Windows devices with the use of Intune and TeamViewer, recently been released uh, to support Windows devices. So if you like this video, uh, please uh, like, subscribe, comment below. And I'll see you next time. See you later.